over by that tree. mom's friends was like walking through campus and they just seen my name on there and they sent to my mom and then I was like whoa I'm actually on there I didn't know what it was at first and then they took a picture of the tower and I'm like whoa I got I really got one of these yeah. I have no idea when did you find out um, I found out when one of my teammates actually Annika I think snapped me a uh, picture I was like what it's here I always ride between my classes I go for year across campus and I I knew it was like around here, so I've like been looking around for it. I found it the other day. Pretty cool. I sent a picture to mom and dad. Really? Love it, yeah. It's kind of a surprise. I never thought I'd get one of these unless you like place or something. So that I got one is pretty cool because it'll be there forever. I was like, whoa, <laughs> I'm in the Hall of Fame. <laughs> I'm proud that uh, I'm representing my country. Uh, especially here at Hillerfield. There's gonna be so many huge races here and like track fans that will be looking for like any name they recognize and I just think that's awesome that that's like part of the stadium now. Really accomplished for some reason. It just made me feel like, okay, like I actually am, I am an Olympian. It's an award for all the hard work, you know? It really did happen and to have a school that like appreciates that and goes like a little bit above and beyond to do something. It does mean a lot. Yeah, it brings like a lot of pride. It's more motivation, honestly, because I don't want to just be on it for the relay. I want to be on it for more than one thing. So I find it very cool that this is just a starting point so that I can build on from this and hopefully get more going on. Yeah, it's definitely more motivating, I would say, than a pressure because I know some of my friends will be here at World Championships and I think it's definitely something that I'll, I'll want to show them. Oh, uh, I mean, I saw my teammates. Of course, Mikai, Anita, Charlie, and Cole. Uh, shout out to Cole. <laughs> Just to know you've got like fellow ducks there, and like I was meeting up with Cole almost every other night to have dinner, and like it just kind of like replicates what we're doing here. It was cool seeing my teammates that I've trained with all year also there. So it was just, I don't know, it was more of a, an achievement for all of us, I, I think. What got me to the Olympics was getting in this groove, being around friends, just working hard and even though you're there representing your country, I felt like it was just another an Oregon beat.